whose sacred head thou wounded with grief and shame lay down, now scornfully surrounded with thorns, thine only crown. How pale thou art with anguish, with sore abuse and scorn. How does that visage languish, which once was bright as morn? What thou, my Lord, hast suffered was all for sinner's gain. Mine, mine was the transgression, but thine the deadly pain. Lo, here I fall, my Savior, tis I deserve thy place. Look on me with thy favor, vouchsafe to me thy grace. What language shall I borrow to thank thee, dearest friend, for this thy dying sorrow, thy pity without end? O oh, make me thine forever, and should I fainting be, Lord, let me never, never outlive my love to thee. My shepherd now receive me, my guardian owns me thine. Great blessings thou didst give me, O source of gifts divine. Thy lips have often fed me with words of truth and love. Thy spirit oft hath led me to heavenly joys above. Here will I stand beside thee, from thee I will not part. O Savior, do not chide me when breaks thy loving heart, when soul and body languish in death's cold, cruel grasp. Then in thy deepest anguish, thee in my arms I'll clasp. The joy can never be spoken above all joys beside, when in thy body broken I thus with safety hide. O Lord of life, desiring thy glory now to see, beside thy cross expiring, I breathe my soul to thee. My Savior, be thou near me when death is at my door, then let thy presence cheer me, forsake me nevermore. When soul and body languish, O oh, leave me not alone, but take away mine anguish by virtue of thine own. Be thou my consolation, my shield when I must die. Remind me of thy passion when my last hour draws nigh. Mine eyes shall then behold thee, upon thy cross shall dwell. My heart by faith enfolds thee, who dieth thus dies well.